everyone welcome back to my channel today i am doing a weekly check-in for um our envelopes and stuff i know we did spend um quite a bit on a couple of envelopes so i kind of wanted to do a video kind of see where we're at for this next week um if you watched my previous video we budget for every two weeks um so every paycheck is supposed to last us last us for two weeks um, so we only stuff, do a cash stuffing once every two weeks. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to go through my envelopes and see what we have. I know we've been eating out a lot. So that one, um, is always really, really hard for us. But anyway, okay, I'm going to get started. So first, um, I have my, our eating out fund which is this envelope right here. And we had stuffed, how much was it? 120. Now I know that these are a bunch of ones, so I know it's not gonna be anything near <laughs> what we had um, last week. What really, really gets us is as soon as the weekend comes, you know, we eat out Friday night, Saturday night, Sunday night you know, and that's basically all of our eating out money. And then during the week, we do eat out maybe once, twice, but it's the weekend that gets us every time because we either go to a sit down restaurant or, um, you know, but anyway, <clears throat> so we had 120 last week and right now we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 13, 14, 15, 16 dollars out of 120. Oh my gosh. So that means that we spent how much? Hold on, let me grab my calculator. I can't do math like off the top of my head. I have to double check it. I know I could probably do it off the top of my head, but you know what I mean. Okay, minus, uh, how much did I say? 16? Wow, we spent 104 dollars. Just like last weekend and maybe once eating out this week. Yeah, so it's gonna be $5 pizzas and, cause this is supposed to last us for this next week. Um, so yeah, we haven't ate, ate out, we didn't eat out last night. Uh, we didn't eat out today, today's Saturday. So yeah, um, that's gonna have to last us. Okay. Next one is groceries. Now groceries, I still keep on my on our bank because we usually do like a Walmart uh, pickup or delivery. But I had budgeted 250 for two weeks, and we only spent 87 dollars because um, I found this new grocery store here where we're where we're living at. It's called Aldi. We didn't have one back home. Um, we're back where we used to live, but I tried it out because I heard it was really affordable and I, we spent just for like our necessities, which are like bread, milk, eggs. Um, I think it was $54 and then my husband went back to Walmart, I think on Thursday to grab ingredients so I could make shrimp cocktail and that was 33. So let me see. So we did 54 at Aldi plus 33 at Walmart. That's 87. So since I stuffed, quote unquote, stuffed 250, which I just leave in the bank, minus 87. So I, we still have 163 for this coming week, which is pretty good. Um, so yeah, there's that. So groceries has nothing in here because we do it all through our bank still. Um, let's see, miscellaneous had nothing. Household had 40. What did I use? Oh, I bought some cleaning stuff to, um, like dust the furniture, some, some dish soap. So I had 40 in there and now I have $7 left, which I think are probably just going to stay in there because I don't know what else we need to buy for household. And then, of course, um, deposit, there's nothing. Spending, there's nothing there. So 
So that's where we're at. $16 for eating out and $7 for household. Wow, I'm, I'm shocked at eating out. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna move on to our um, sinking funds. Now our birthdays, I had stuffed $95 in here. And in total, I had 150. But I did go to Target. I did buy the the graduation card and the two birthday cards I wanted to buy, which leaves so there should be 134 in here. So there's 50, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's 90. Wait, 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 what? Okay, yeah, I'm telling you, every time I count the 50s, okay. So, I'm just going to do 50 separate. <laughs> 2, 4, 6, 8. I'm sorry, I cannot calculate it, that in my head. Okay, 130 plus 4. Yep. There's 134 in here left. And this is to uh, basically fill those... those uh, cards with either gift cards or money so that's good I have a good amount left over next I had stuffed fun which was a hundred but we did go to a video game museum and that was $34 for the admission for four of us so I should have how much in here 66 so that's two four six sixty five sixty six Perfect. Holidays, we didn't spend anything on, so there should be 50 in there, and there is. This is actually for, uh, we're saving up for Halloween for the boys' costumes. So that's what holidays is for. So we haven't touched that. Christmas, of course, we haven't touched. That has 350 in it. Um, Brody's, so Brody, I had withdrawn $150. But then we uh, found a dresser for the nursery on Facebook Marketplace that she was selling for 150 and she only took cash. So the only place I could think of was Brody's envelope. So <clears throat> we took it out of here, but what we ended up doing with Brody's um, envelope is we have another separate account where we have, um, so Brody has his own savings Landon has his own savings and then we have a separate checking account for them specifically in case like we want to buy them anything and I think what we're going to do is just take that money the 150 out of there um or you you're, or just leave it in there and just note that okay we have 150 in there instead of taking out 150 and I don't know okay so that's what we're going to do with that so his 150 is actually in a separate checking account. I know that's super confusing, but the way that our money situation is right now, because we had to switch banks, because we moved to a completely different um, area, and it's just like a hot mess right now. So that's where Brody's money is. Um, Landon, did, okay, so I had stuff 40. Um, yeah, I did add 40. He should he had 103 and then I spent $43 on clothes at Target because Target was having a sale on the kids clothes. I think the shirts were $3. Short uh shorts were $5, something like that. So there should be $60 in here. Why do I see a one? $1 bill. 20, 30, 40, 45, 46. Why do I have 47? Oh, he bought him. Oh, okay. I remember. He bought a toy while we were at Target. Okay. So 60 minus, how much do I have in here? 30, 40, 45, 46, 47. So 60 minus 47 is 13. So let me write that here. I don't know the date. But I know he bought a toy and something else. Oh, a little a sippy cup that he liked. So minus 13. That should give me what I have there. 
47. 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47. Yep. Okay. Oops. So he has 47. Yep. <clears throat> Put this this way. Okay, and then vacation, we had put 80. There's still 200 in there. Savings challenges haven't been touched. Okay, so I think that's it. That's my weekly check-in for this week. Um, like I said, eating out is looking kind of, we're struggling on eating out, but <laughs> um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Everything that I've shown here, I'm gonna link down below. If there's something I didn't link, feel free to leave me a comment and I'll and I'll find the link for you. I know there's a bunch of stuff. I bought things from, you know, so many different Etsy shops and Amazon and whatnot. But if there's something that you don't see um, linked, uh, please let me know and I'll, I'll give you guys a link for it, okay? Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!